Hey guys, it's Michelle. Welcome back to my channel. I finally got my long awaited cloth and paper order in and I'm gonna do the unboxing with you here today. Now I'm waiting on a couple more orders to come in, one of which is my December subscription box. It's my very first box. So I'm really excited to see what's inside. This one is just a regular order I play, so I'm kind of jumping ahead. And I will admit I've ordered a lot from Cloth and Paper in the last month, but that's because I'm just starting my planner and so I needed everything. So I needed all my dashboards, I needed all of my dividers, I needed stickers, inserts, the whole shebang. So. There is a reason for the madness. But let's get into this unboxing. So let's just move this out of the way. And here we have it. Dun, 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 dun. All right, let's see what we got. Okay, so I always have to show the front of the box. There's luxury and simplicity. I want to keep that fresh in my mind. So this here is the free gift. So in December, they were giving away a free gift, two different free gifts, depending on how much you order. This is, I think, a credit card holder. I'm sorry, a business card holder. Yeah, so this is nice. I already have a BMW one. I'm a BMW girl, so I might give this one to my mommy. Yeah, it's nice though, it feels good. It's that pebble leather. It feels really good. All right, this is what I ordered. All right, should I move this out of the way? Yeah, let's get that out of the way. We don't need that. All right, so I got my clips. And the girls on YouTube call these something, I can't remember what they call them, but cloth and paper calls them cloth and paper clip duo. So I'm super excited to get these. And what you use these for, what I see a lot of people do is on this part of their planner, they'll just clip it here to clip like maybe one of the, um, the journaling cards or just something you wanna keep in front, they'll put it there just to have it in their planner if they need it. And then they also will, group together pages in their planner like put it right here to keep this section together <clears throat> and i like the color this is the aesthetic of my planner that's the color scheme that i got going on oh and i got some sticky notes so i didn't have any really nice sticky notes so i just wanted to get some that match the color of my planner now, normally, you know, I'm a Tiffany girl too. So normally I get the Tiffany blue post-it note. So we, we get the, um, the multicolor pack and I just pull out all of the Tiffany blue ones and I just leave all the pinks and yellows for everyone else. All right, but I have some to match my planner. So this one is just linen sticky notes and it doesn't say the color, but it's a pretty, like a cream color. And this one is Outbox Sticky Notes in Champagne. And you get 50 sheets and they're three by three. All right. All right, so this says to keep. I like the little pouch. It's a, a really nice card stock. So these must be my assorted journaling cards. This looks like that's in French, can't pronounce it. Now this one I like, it says start over. The art to survive is to start over, believe. No, the art to survive is to, the art to survive is to believe you can always start over. There we go, I like this one. So I got the assorted journaling cards to have something inspirational in my planner. Um, so I will probably, put this one here or I don't know. I'm gonna put it somewhere where I can see it uh, when I go to my calendar, my planner on a daily basis. But, and I also thought I was gonna get more journaling cards. I thought I was gonna get at least four, but um, maybe this is in my journaling cards. Maybe, so this actually, you know what guys, this is my packing slip. So maybe these are just some freebies. See, I'm complaining and look at cloth and paper giving me free stuff. 
Oh, I tell you, people just ugh, can't be nice to people, right? All right, so I got my sticky notes. Not my sticky notes, my, uh, my, my stickers. I got all these stickers because I'm a, I like to color code. Uh, so I like to color code dates in my calendar. I have a lot going on at work. You know, my planner is a work and personal planner, so it's a catch-all. So I got these. I wasn't sure which colors I was gonna use, but I wanted to have enough of a variation that they would be meaningful, right? I don't want the colors to be too close to each other. Like these two are kind of close, but they're different shapes. So that's how I can separate those. But um, these are pretty. So these are Monaco drops and like, a, um, they're all in the same like color family. But this is more, is, is more like a dark pink or burgundy Monaco drops. We got rose dots, mauve dots. All right, so these are nice because these are dark and these are light and these are a little bit darker and a different uh, shape. Then I have more mauve dots. So these might be, these are the same. I got two of those. Okay, mauve dots. Okay, it tells you the color. Okay, oob drops. And I love the drop stickers. I just like the shape. I like those. Okay, oob. And oh, I got some pink. So these are cotton drops. Oh my gosh. So I have to tell you, so the color of my office, right? My home office is um, black and white. The walls are gray, all of our walls are gray. But it's black and white with pink and gold highlights. And it sounds like a lot, but it's not because the pink and the gold are just accent colors. So they're strategically placed in my office. And I kind of want to go for the same color scheme in my planner. So that's why I got some pink, uh, cause I can't just have black and white stickers, right? That doesn't make sense. All right, and then here's some green. These are called Amalfi Coast. So kind of like the beach. I like that color. That puts me in a happy place. And I want my planner to put me in a happy place. So that's my whole, you know, zhuzh I got going on with all of my supplies. It's just happy, uh, pleasant. All right, so these are fond dots and these look kind of gray. So these are nice, nice neutral color. And then these are drops in Ibiza. So I have some drops in beignet and they're a little bit lighter than these, but these are really gonna go well with all, what I've already started to do on my planner. Let me show you. So my planner inserts start in January, so I haven't really started um, using my planner yet, but I have marked off some dates. So this is my January calendar and you can see I have some dates uh, highlighted with the beignet uh, drop stickers. And so that's what I was saying with the Ibiza because they're a lot darker than the uh, beignet that I think these are gonna really match well. I'm gonna start using these in January, I think. Yep, to mark off different uh, important dates on my, this is my monthly view. And the boxes are so small, I can't write everything I want inside. So I'm gonna have to use the stickers uh, to be a little bit creative. All right, so we got the stickers and my journaling inserts. I used to journal all the time. Um, and for some reason I stopped and I think I just got so busy but I went through a period this earlier this year where I was so stressed out, guys. I had to go see a therapist and everything. And so I wanna start journaling just to express how I'm feeling at the beginning and or the end of each day. And this would just help me track my, um, my mental health and my personal growth and all that good stuff. So um these are my monthly journaling it says monthly mood tracking journal entries plus affirmations okay nice i like that and then i got a bunch of dashboards because i need to separate my planner right i have to be able to easily get to my different sections and so i wanted some very inspirational dashboards to keep me inspired as i use my planner and this one is the believe your mind believes everything you tell it and it just says that over and over and over for three uh columns so this is nice and 
it's a little peekaboo here for something to go here so this is nice i'll have to find someplace nice to put that in my planner and this one is own your own story you know i had to have this one of course because it just says it all and then believe in yourself, which I do. I'm a very confident person, but you know, things happen that kind of throw you off your confidence game. And uh, so it's, it, I just think it's nice to just surround myself with very positive, inspiring messages to myself. So this one says, believe in yourself. You are braver than you think, more talented than you know, and capable of more than you imagine. And I'm gonna read this too on my own, I'm gonna read it to you right now, but I'm gonna read it just to, you know, I'm gonna feed my soul with that. Oh, and the back, look at the back. Oh, that's nice. And see, I love the dimension here. I love anything that's different and has texture and just aesthetically pleasing is what I like to call it. And that goes with my clothes, that goes with my furnishings in my house, it, clearly it goes with my planner. So this is just right up my alley here. I, I love this. I don't remember that being on the back, but that was a nice surprise. Believe in yourself. And then my purchase trackers. Now listen guys, I just told you about all the stuff that I ordered from Cloth and Paper this month, right? Well, I've ordered some stuff from Amazon too. I mean, who doesn't order from Amazon all the time? I don't have to get in my car and go shopping and pick it up. Are you kidding me? Uh, sign me up. And I really needed the <laughs> these purchase tracker sheets to track my freaking cloth and paper and Amazon orders. But I've been just writing them. I've been using my planner. And so these are some December sheets that I ordered off of, off of Amazon. And these are Filofax. I freaking hate them. They're in comparison to the cloth and paper. These are just so, it's just copy paper with stuff printed on it. They're so flimsy, but you know, they, they get the job done. So I just tracked my cloth and paper orders here. And one thing I can tell you guys is when you get your orders in, open your packing slip and compare uh, what you receive to the packing slip and compare it to your order on uh, cloth and paper just to make sure you got everything. I thought I didn't get something and it was totally my mistake, but I highlighted it. Um, and I checked everything else off. But this is where I've been keeping track of my orders. And then somewhere else, see, I can't even find it. Oh, right here, my Amazon uh, orders right here. So anyway, that's why I need my purchase trackers. So I'm glad I finally got these. All right, so you guys, that's it. I'm not gonna put this in my planner yet. I think I'm gonna wait for my December box subscription box to come because I have a lot more stuff in there. And then I'm going to put my planner together once I get all my orders in and I'm gonna come back and show you guys my final planner setup, okay? And I did show you my initial planner setup. I'll link that video at the top. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Until then, wishing you a very Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays.